What if it's not a bird at all? It doesn't sound like it's coming from the sky. It sounds like it's coming from across the lot. How much do you want to bet those are the sound waves they used to penetrate people's privacy, to look inside their homes? Because I've heard it used here. I've heard it used over at Walmart. I've heard it used at Queen Elizabeth. I assumed it was a trained bird. But what if it's these sounds that are that make them be able to see inside a person's vehicle or home? Huh. It's either a trained bird or it's that. One of the two. So this taxi driver has had to pay three times and now he's had to get the pump restarted three times. What are the odds of this? What's going on here? Okay, so we were alone with one taxi driver who kept on stalling and didn't choose his grade of fuel. Now, th two other ta three other taxis have arrived in a jeep. I just had a guy looking at me rather very suspiciously I, as I'm putting stuff away. When she apologized for for the crazy of the taxi driver and I said, oh, this is no problem. I see this all the time in my life. And she gave me the most beautiful smile I had seen in a long time. But, um, I gotta put my foot. Okay, now I'm pumping my fuel and it's pumping very slow. But half the speed it normally does. That's my automatic shutoff going clickety clack. Now, when this thing's going on full, it doesn't do that unless there's too much pressure in the tank already. From what? I've only had like an eighth to a quarter tank in there. And this is what it does when it's almost full. Why is there a shitload of pressure in my tank? Uh, I decided I, I'm tired of all these setups. I'm tired of people trying to fuck with my head, uh, hypnotize me. Uh, while I was building my bench today, um, I, somebody walked by and muttered something under their breath. And I, and I just laughed a little bit and said, oh yeah? Well, um, let's, let, let's see something you've done. And the next thing I know, they're walking away and as they get to the corner, I'm grabbing for my uh, Dr. Pepper, and uh, and I go to open it, and it starts fizzing like like this. This would have like fizzed all over me if I didn't have such quick reflexes. And um, it was a really strange thing because it hadn't been shaken, but it was fully charged. And uh, and when I turned to look at the guys on the corner, they were gone. So I mean, like I didn't get myself. But there was no question. Somebody stopped time for me or something. I wonder what that was. Anyways, the fact is, is that uh, something happened that I don't remember where he shook that bottle. Somebody shook that fucking bottle of Dr. Pepper I had. Uh, so it would fizz all over me because I was being cocky with these guys. Because these guys are... Thanks. You too. All right, so something else I want to relate. I was at um, I was at McDonald's uh, by Maple Ridge, not in Maple Ridge, but by it. Uh, and um, the guy in front of me kept complaining about his food, and and then gave the lady something, and she didn't return for like 15 minutes. I don't know, well, not 15 minutes, probably about five minutes. But still, five minutes. I had time to t turn off my van. You know, I could hear. It behind me it was it, I got out I took a look at my gas tank it was actually the car's engine behind me but still it sounded exactly like somebody was draining my propane and then uh, I got out of there I just fucking started up my van I reversed until buddy honked at me and then I fucking jacked it left and boom I'm out 
uh, uh, jacked it right, sorry, and boom, uh, I'm out of there. I went to the Burger King uh, about a couple, two blocks up, and the strangest thing happened. There was nobody in sight, and they're turning around and saying, uh, our system's down for half an hour. Okay, fine. So I come down to A&W, and then uh, there's this car with a license plate CA558, uh, CA558X. Uh, plate I recognize from Point Grey most of the time and um, and then this girl who handed me my food also offered me a free drink oh uh, the cu customer didn't want the combo would you like a free drink now they poisoned my food many times and done like put shit in my food I'm making a break for it uh, a day before uh, a day before uh, I was going to because I, I got a day of work from from a guy but they were fucking with my van tonight uh, and I barely managed to stop them and so I just I've, I've had enough of this shit I've just fucking had enough of this shit I'm hitting the road I'm hitting the road and I am going to somewhere that hopefully uh, I'll be able to weed out the good from bad Okay, I uh, looked for a place to stop for the night. If you can see, there's a vehicle down there at the intersection, watching. There's a fucking bird, trained bird, out the fuck here. I'm halfway in between fucking Maple Ridge and fucking uh, Mission right now. And they follow me the fuck out here. With a trained bird. The train bird followed me out here. What the fuck? I also have something going on with my engine. There's somebody behind my van. Hello? What the fuck is going on here? I'm far removed from civilization. I shouldn't be near anybody. Okay, so I'm in a perfectly quiet place. Two vehicles just went around the corner there. After I told some people to fuck off around here and I got back in my driver's seat from being in the back. Uh, and there's still one vehicle sitting right at the entrance of that intersection over there. All right, so it was reading over a half tank, just over a half tank. You see I'm at 225 kilometers. Uh, I left at uh, 158 and uh, she, uh, in the first 50 kilometers, only showed signs of an eighth of a tank drop. And so now we're gonna start her up. And remember, we are in the middle of buttfuck nowhere, in the middle of the night. It's like fucking uh, two o'clock in the morning. And I purposely did this because at 2 a.m. there shouldn't be anybody on the highways, hardly a car usually. Um, at 2 a.m. there shouldn't be anybody near an industrial park in the middle of nowhere. And look, there's another fucking vehicle. Where the fuck are these people coming from and going? What the fuck? I'm in the middle of fucking nowhere. Where are all these people coming from? Seriously. Seriously. Oh my god. I felt something go. I felt something like, you know, like a full balloon burst or something inside my engine where before she had power, she had everything, and now she's like, she, it's like 
there's been a governor fuel governor put on her where I can't get enough fuel into the engine over like 1500 rpm so I can't go any more than 900 or 90 down the road um, so it's like 900 that would be great but anyways now um, the fact is I'm really tired it's four o'clock in the morning and I've just driven Phoenix 30 kilometers or so on uh, at 90 at 90 and sputtering and like I, th I think it's her main fuel line from the evaporator to the mixer. That was weird. I swear I just saw a flicker of somebody in my mirror. And I swear somebody just moved aside this in the back here. Well, I got incense burning because I just took a poop. It's four o'clock in the morning. I gotta go to bed because obviously my eyes are playing tricks. It's probably just traffic lights. Right? Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> Am I uh, disturbing the parking lot here? <laughs> this sometimes happens when I'm in an unwelcome spot. So we'll be the loving one and let them have their peace and I'll have mine. <laughs>